Hi, I am Husky Light. Welcome to my channel. Thank you for stopping by and thank you so much for your likes, your shares, your subscribes, your Google Pluses, kind comments, everything. Thank you so, so much for all your support that you give me every day. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Um, right, Leo, your stars for the week. We are going from Monday the 10th of August through to Sunday the 16th of August and we are starting off with the Ten of Cups in reverse and that is in your health um, and your spiritual position. So health wise, um, reverse Ten of Cups is a reminder that in this day and age we must all guard against holding ourselves up to impossible standards and this is what you seem to be doing this week or maybe tempted to do this week we don't stay young forever unfortunately we can stave off the wrinkles a little bit and we can stave off and we can live for longer nowadays with with technology the way it is and vitamins and and health but we can't stay young forever everyone's physical strength um, does wane slightly as we get older um, given the years we know we know all this However, it's no excuse to ignore the part of us that, that we all play in our own health, okay? You are either gonna go, <laughs> you're either going one way or the other. You're either over-exercising and trying desperately to keep those years at bay, slow down a little bit and just accept that you are getting older. Or for some of you, on the other scale of things, you are not actually you, you are accepting growing gold uh, very graciously. In fact, you can't really be bothered that you're growing older. You need to do a little bit more exercise, um, try and up your vitamins, and yes, you are getting older, but you can still do some exercise. So you're either going from one extreme or the other this week, whichever way you're coming from. So either cool down a little bit on the exercise or start the exercise if you haven't already started and just start to make a little few changes um, to your health regime if you have one and if you don't have one make one this week spiritually you need to focus on you need to give lots of thanks and everything to the many blessings that you've got in your life you have got so many blessings in your life stop comparing yourself to other people don't com compare yourself to other people because the, if you compare yourself to other people, you will always find something in another person that that is better than yourself. It's an illusion, everybody. If you don't have that comparison, then you're wonderful yourself. So don't make that comparison with anybody else because you're bound to find something you're not happy with. So don't do that. It doesn't matter if somebody is more spiritually advanced than you or not or whatever the case may be. Stop comparing please this week the ten of cups is reminding you that at every moment you need to stay stay in the now you need to just be you need to seize the day no matter what your circumstances no matter what is going on around you you have got so much to be grateful for within your own life and you need to build on that and you need to recognize that especially this week um so I'm sorry I'm telling everybody off, it's not me, it's my guides and angels that are doing this. Um, right, we have also got the devil in the reverse position. Now this is in your career and your money. Okay, so when the devil card is reversed in a job um, that you think may be permanent or really, really secure, it's not. It may be that it's not as secure as you think it is, so just be aware of that. It doesn't have to be a bad thing. It's just knowing, um, or maybe you will find out it's not as secure as you once thought it was. But the fact that you actually know about it is a good thing, because if you know about it, then you can take steps to remedy that situation. You can start to look, look for another job, um, or you can start to work harder and make sure that, that you're indispensable in that job. Um, it's just it, you're going to know uh, that things may not be as secure as you once thought they were in a long standing in job um, 
so it could be that um and it could be a case of maybe somebody has promised you a pay rise and then they're going to take it back somebody's promised you a promotion suddenly that gets reversed on you it could be situations like that um and pensions that sort of thing you just be aware of things like that this week it's not for all of you it's just for for some of you um so just be aware of your security if you're in a job if you're unhappy in a job situation which you've been enduring just because of that security that you think is there just just stay aware aware that this is a choice that you are making that you're making this choice to stay in this bad job and um, it's your responsibility you have made that choice um, and if you absolutely hate it and you feel trapped in it it's you that's put yourself there and it's you can that can change that situation and become untrapped that's just an illusion you're not trapped in anything unless you allow yourself to be trapped and there's always options of one sort or another which you can find if you try um, so be aware of that as well in your finances um, in a reverse position it's indicating that things may be this week quite tight for you financially or at least in the very very near future in the next few days it's going to be really important for you to try not to resent whatever has happened that brings about uh, this tightness in finances or this lack of money deal calmly with it deal rationally with it it could be a huge bill that's coming in you could have just spent too much on your holidays whatever the reason is take one step at a time whatever the situation it's not permanent you will get over it it's temporary if you need financial help at any point this week don't be afraid or too proud to ask for it there's always help available in one form or another just don't be too proud to ask for it um if you've draw if if you've got the doubt we've got the devil in the reverse but if you're looking at it and saying well hang on everything seems all right and my money seems to be flowing quite well now um it is still telling you just to be aware because things may change at any moment or maybe it's telling you that you need to put them away a little bit for a rainy day maybe something's coming up that you're not aware of yet that is going to come in okay um queen of cups in the upright position is your friends and your family members around you queen of cups is one of the most loving nurturing uh beautiful cards in the pack um she could stand in for an actual person maybe one of your family um probably a female but it could be a male with with feminine qualities hair on the lighter end if this is somebody within your family just know that they've got your corner that they are really really supporting you and they are behind you in whatever situation you're going through this week and they're really on your side and you can go to them for help if you need help if you don't have somebody within your family who is like this or shows these tendencies just know that it's you and it's reminding you to treat yourself with with love with compassion to nurture yourself to love yourself this week be good to yourself and by being good to yourself and loving yourself then that will shine out to your friends and family around you and they will react and give you that love and kindness back that you're giving to yourself so it could go either way with that one and the last card we have got is the star in reverse and this is for your love situation so even reversed in love is still really really nice for love relationships especially love relationships that have been going a while or you're dating you're with somebody it could be that you could have maybe a couple of stumbling blocks this week and um, that you need to get over either on your side or your partner's side or both where you need to come to this hump in the road and you think okay we've, we've come to a blockage what do we do about this work through it together talk about it you will come shining through on the other side and you'll be absolutely fine if 
you are single and you have been looking for love, okay, just make sure that there is nothing standing in your way of finding your next love, of finding your next relationship. Is your self-esteem high enough? Is your self-confidence? Are you ready for another relationship? Um, or could it go the other way? Is your self-esteem or your confidence or whatever way too high and you're, you're almost being a little bit arrogant about things? See how you feel about yourself and that is a real reflection of how other people see you and feel about you. And if you feel good about yourself, if you love yourself to a good degree, but not too high or too low, and you're you're doing all right, then get out there. It's a really good indicator that you will find somebody very soon and they will come into your life, providing all is well with yourself. So that is your reading for this week, Leo. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to look out for your moon sign and your sun, moon sign and your rising sign as well. If you would like a personal reading from me, just click on the link above. If there's any certain situations or things that you are having a problem with that you can't find answers to, then I'll get you booked in and uh, we'll get to the bottom of that for you. So, namaste, love you loads, and I will speak to you soon. Bye.